Hey guys, so today we're going to get on into June favorites. Um, it's really funny because I actually took a poll on Facebook and favorites got like an overwhelming response over doing a review or even announcing a giveaway. So I was like, wow, I guess you guys really like favorites. Um, I honestly didn't know, so thank you uh, for that feedback. Um, but let's get right into it. Uh, so let's see, I want to start with hair stuff. Okay, so this is a product that I have been using literally I think not like when I first BC but shortly thereafter because I initially had the coconut pudding and then rather than re-up that even though I still buy the coconut pudding sometimes I decided to get this one and I love it um, I think it's a little bit more moisturizing than the coconut one it's a little bit richer um, I'm actually almost out of it and it smells like coffee sort of and I just ordered three more jars of this during Komaz's sale because I had to get free shipping. And that's, this was like really the only product that I wanted. So I was like, well, I'm just going to get three so they could like last me a long time. Um, and this product, since I was trying to, um, you know, make my wash and go to not look like a wet cat. This was one of the first products that I tried like when I was like testing things out, trying to see what I was going to continue to use. And this worked like a freaking charm. And I was like, oh my God, I knew I had you around for a reason. And it's like, you can use this by itself. You don't need to use the leave-in with it. Um, you could get a little bit more uh, of a softer hold if you use the leave-in with it. But this is just like an all around great pudding for me. Um, if you want to say, it's, I mean, it's like a creamy gel, like I said. Um, but if you want to talk about in terms of just using like um, a pudding or a curl cream on your hair rather than using a gel, I'm going to say that this is the best one I've used. It's actually the one, only one that's still on my holy grail list. Some other ones I took off because of ingredients or something like that, but this one is the bomb. Uh, so, moving along. Um, so, actually, which pairs great with this is my Reve Hair and Body Butter. This is their like pure butter blend. Obviously, um, if you know how I do my hair, I use this to seal my ends um, at the end of my routine so I can just use this this and be done. And it has really great ingredients. It's basically like a shea butter mix with some oils thrown in, but they're awesome oils. Um, this is a strawberry scent. Like I said, that's like my signature Reve scent. Um, and I just really love this stuff. And it smells so good. And it's also like, I think this um, took the place of the uh, Kemet butter, uh, the twisting butter on my Holy Grail list because I was like, kind of on the fence about adding the Kemet. And um, this one is only $12 for eight ounces. Well, I feel like Kemet is like, if I get it from uh, Erewhon, it's like $18. And I think, what is that, like four or five ounces? So yeah, this is gonna last me forever because I've been using it for the past month or so. And it's like barely even gone. And I just like put it on my ends. Um, you can also use this on your skin if you want. But I usually like to save my Reve products for my hair. Um, moving along. So to match my strawberry butter, I got this really awesome strawberry body mist from The Body Shop. Um, it smells really, really good. It actually, it smells really natural. Um, I found that some places can have like fruity smells and they smell like really perfumey fruity, like you mix a fruit with a flower. But this is just like straight up strawberry, like strawberry patch or something like that so I really like this and I really like to pair it and um, use that as my body spray if I'm using the Reve butter or um, the strawberry moisturizer any of those products in my hair I just think they are the bees knees together um uh, let's see um oh I forgot a hair product I usually like to do these in order like hair body makeup or something then like random um but anyway uh, this is the Herbal Essences Long Term Relationship. This is a newcomer to my Holy Grail list on my drugstore list for rinse out conditioners. And I really, really like this conditioner. I was really pleasantly surprised um, by this conditioner. It has a really great slip and it makes my hair really soft after I use it. Um, even after like I'm out of the shower, um, it doesn't like dry my hair out quickly or anything like that. And it's a great detangler. Um, I also for my rosemary challenge have been mixing like 12 drops of rosemary essential oil into this huge bottle and then I just like shake it up 
and have like a good old time. Um, so I'm definitely going to continue to use this. I've actually already used a full bottle of this. This is my second bottle. Um, and just so you know, just before you try to get mad at me, um, it does have biz and you know, purple dimethicone. Um, that is a cone that is, it's not total, it's not water soluble, but it's one that's, it's like a more advanced cone. So it doesn't really like contribute to build up like some of the harsher cones can. So that one I'm generally fine with. Um, and it also has sodium hydroxide towards the bottom as a pH balancer. I know some people freak out about sodium hydroxide, but obviously you can see my hair is still curly and I've been using this like almost every day for the past like three weeks or something like that. So I really don't think it's gonna relax your hair, but if you wanna be cautious, feel free. Uh, last product I have, um, I got a new makeup. It is the Bare Minerals, this is the matte one. Um, I actually have the regular one too, but so here's what had happened. I was in um, DC for work and the regular one, it has, it has like more of a dewy type complexion, but it was so humid and so hot in DC. It was, it was like 90 degrees. So I, my face was all shiny because I didn't need any dew because I was already freaking dying. So I actually went to Macy's while on my lunch break and was like, yo, I need the hookup. Um, so the guy um, gave me this one. This is medium beige. And he was like, a lot of people will use the matte in summer and then the regular formula in winter. So I still have the regular one and I still like what it does to my skin. Um, and I'm just going to use that when it gets colder outside. For, so for summer, I'm sticking with this one. And also, um, one of the things I really like about this makeup is that it feels really light. I hate the feeling of makeup on my face. Like, half the time, I don't even wear makeup because I just don't like feeling caked on. I don't like hugging someone and being like, and just being conscious of the fact that I'm like, oh my god, like, I know I have all this, like, makeup on. Like, is it going to rub off on them? I hate that. And I, and I still don't even wear a lot of foundation when I do... Um, wear like a liquid foundation and then these last a pretty long time like it doesn't just wear off like as the day goes on so and then it also I was using um, the benefit powder previously to this one and that one like if I wore it like three days in a row even if I wash my face at night um, my skin started to get really irritated so I had to let that one go but anyway so this is that and I mean I guess Hi sirens, like really? Shut up. I live in Los Angeles, can't you tell? So I swear, it's like in this city, someone is always like there's always like a helicopter running around and or not running around, flying around trying to catch some like random criminal and just I'm like what? Like save that for some other place. I don't know. Um, but anyway, so while we're on here, I feel like I might as well announce the Intouch giveaway. So we are going to do um, a giveaway for Intouch. If you don't know, the Silk Taj Serum is on my Holy Grail list for like straightening hair, like blowing your hair out or flat ironing. I think it's a really stellar oil. Um, so the Intouch folks reached out to me and um, I decided to do a giveaway when my blog reached um, adult status, i.e. I had 18,000 subscribers, like 18 adult, ha ha, funny, funny, woo woo. Um, so anyway, so we're gonna do a giveaway. Um, I'm gonna let it run until the end of next week. So whenever, what's the end of next week? Okay, I'm back. I totally had to like check and see um, what day I wanted to end the giveaway on. So we're gonna let it run until July 16th. I believe that is a Monday. Um, and what we're going to do is give away three full-size bottles of the Intouch Silk Taj Oil. Now, in order to um, enter this giveaway, all I want you to do is go to Facebook and like the Intouch page. I'm going to link it in the details below. Once you have done that, um, just leave me a message and say, like, Silk Taj me. So, any, you know, you can say whatever you want, but Silk Taj me sounds like fun. Um, but anyway, so that's really it. Um, this is going to be opening U.S. residents only, unfortunately. Um, but yeah, that is all I really got to say. If you have any questions about the giveaway, feel free to ask me. I'm going to put the full details in my details as well. So please read them. Um, all right. I will talk to you guys later. Bye.